Um, we have a message from Finland. It was nice to meet you in January. I remember, I remember. Do you think the meet and greet's gonna happen after this? Thank you, Vesku, for that um, question. What we're looking at, because the most important thing is your safety, our safety, and the safety of all our families when we go home after gigs. So what everyone is looking at, at the speed of light, is what I'm calling security hygiene. And what we're saying, promoters, artists, um, and the government, is that we need to get the, the security hygiene to a T. Because remember, we all go into a venue, we group together, we use the toilets, we drink at the bar, we eat at the food vendors. How do we get that hygiene? And we're gonna need that for at least 12 months um, until we all are, have access to a vaccine. I think spacing is, is a pretty, optimistic thing to ask for. I, I just don't see how it can happen. People shout out, people dance, um, people celebrate at concerts. But the, we need to get the economy going. We need to get venues, clubs, um, cabaret venues, theatres, West End, festivals. We need to get them going. Um, the artists need to work. I mean, unlike my husband who has really good royalties, my income is completely stalled for 12 months and I know it's the same for my band. Um, it's, I think meet and greets can happen once we're vaccinated. If we find a way of doing it where we can be respectfully distant then you know two meters away is going to be a meet and greet rather than shaking hands and i've been thinking about this a lot because the selfie how do you do the selfie there needs to be a brilliant way of reinventing it through this technology where you feel that you've been seen you've been talked to directly and that you feel that you have been addressed as an individual and I have to say, in my experience in the last two months, we have wonderful Darren one running this site, is that we will find ways of personalizing everything and making you feel um, that, you know, we care about you because we do. So I hope that answers your question. Loco Christopher Minx, do you realize the impacts you had on thousands of people with your music and art? 